वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम टू एक्सप्लो बायो इफ यू आर वर्किंग ऑन अ मॉडल ऑर्गेनिज्म सच एज ह्यूमन माइस एरबडोपसिस ट्रोसोफिला यू हैव एक्सेस टू देयर जीनोमिक इन्फॉर्मेशन फॉर प्राइमर डिजाइनिंग बट इफ यू आर वर्किंग ऑन ए स्पीशीज विद लिमिटेड और नो सिक्वेंस इन्फॉर्मेशन एंड यू वॉन्ट टू एम्पलीफाई अर क्लोन अ जीन वट विल यू डू इज इट पॉसिबल टू डिजाइन प्राइमर फॉर सच जीन्स फॉर विच द सिक्वेंस इज नॉट अवेलेबल In today's video I will talk about degenerate primers and how to design them for PCR amplification or cloning of genes in species lacking the sequence information. If you want to amplify a gene or clone it you need to have its complementary primer pair which is easy in case of model organisms with gene sequences available. In case of non-model plants with limited sequence information you can take the sequence of target gene from closely related species which belong to the same genus or family this is done by performing blast homology search i have made a separate tutorial on how to perform a blast you can watch it later next these sequences are aligned using softwares like cluster omega or multiline Sequence of a gene in different organism is known as orthologous or homologous sequences. If you want to know about orthologous and homologous sequences, do watch my video given in the description below. Next, after aligning, identify the conserved region within the genes. If there is a complete homology, then a standard primer may be designed. But if there are one or more mismatched bases, the degenerate primer can be designed. Let's understand this with an example. Consider a target gene sequence of three closely related species obtained using blast search. Species 1 has T at fifth position while in other two species there is a G base. Two different forward primers complementary to each of the known species sequence needs to be designed. This is because in our target species chances are that one of the two bases may be present and thus the chances of PCR amplification increases. In this example the fifth base is the degenerate base the amount of degeneracy is defined by the number of different base mismatches and thus the number of different primers in the mix increasing the number of mismatched bases in the primer sequences increases the degeneracy of the primer in this example reverse primer has 100% match in the related species hence no degeneracy and standard primer can be designed for our species too for performing pcr amplification or cloning all possible degenerate primers forward and reverse are added to the same reaction mixture so that any one of the degenerate primer may bind and amplify the sequence of our target gene for degenerate primer to work efficiently avoid designing the primers having degeneracy at 3 prime end to determine the actual sequence of gene in our organism sequencing of this amplified product may be done If the purpose is cloning of a gene often restriction sites in the form of additional bases as 5 prime end of the primer is added so that's all about the today's video if you find the video useful do share with your friends mention in the comment about any specific video request subscribe to get notified about my latest uploads do check my playlist for other popular videos and finally thanks for watching